Here are the announcements for the week of January 24th. I know many of us are concerned about the various troubles in the world, and so on Wednesday mornings at 11 a.m. during the month of February, I'm going to be leading a discussion on the topic, What Do We Do With Evil? We're going to be using resources from Richard Rohr to inform our conversation and learn how to respond to evil from the perspective of faith. If you're interested in joining the conversation, I would just ask you to please register um, at our website, trinitywillmet.com slash evil, uh, which is kind of a funny uh, web, web page to have <laughs> at a church website, but uh, that's where you go to uh, learn more about the study and to sign up. As the season of Lent approaches, I would invite you to a season of prayer. Um, over the years, I've had the opportunity to visit an Episcopalian Anglican monastery in Cambridge, Massachusetts, for the Society of St. John the Evangelist. And starting February um, 9th, the brothers of the monastery are going to be offering an eight-week study and mini-retreat on themes of the Gospel of John. Uh, these sessions will take place on Tuesday evenings uh, at 6.30 our time, and they'll last about 45 minutes. I'm planning to participate, and I hope that you will consider joining me through Zoom. If you're curious about this, or if your heart is yearning for a time of prayer, then follow the link about Praying John in our weekly e-news. In baptism, we pledge to support the church with our prayers, our presence, our gifts, our service, and our witness. And you, friends, are the ones who are sustaining Trinity's ministry to our congregation and our mission to the wider community and the world. Um, God has blessed us so greatly. We give thanks, and uh, we dedicate ourselves for the purpose of loving and serving our God. Will you pray with me? Merciful God, receive our offerings as you receive our lives. Make your purpose known through us, so that our lives may show forth your glory, even as we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God Almighty, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us always. Amen.